Is it working? I'm afraid to even say anything. I guess it's working. Okay, so not having it back with my first montage. I'll call this the montage of forgotten gameplay videos because that's exactly what it is. Um, a lot of times I record gameplay videos and they don't make it into a, a production. You know, they kind of get left on the cutting room floor for whatever reason. Um, they, they're not necessarily bad gameplay videos. They just don't get you know they they just don't make it for whatever reason and here we have three gameplay videos that i put together into a montage for your viewing pleasure because i was fucking bored and i haven't made a video in a long time not a long time it's been like a week i don't know what's a long time fuck i don't know it's all subjective to whoever for me it's been a long time i was like i got 36 fucking subscribers looking up looking up to me okay they want to see some of my shit so let me stop being a douchebag and make a video no uh i've been busy this past week week and a half i got a new job i was finishing up school and you know um i had to change shifts and everything so i just been running around but everything is getting to where um everything is getting back to normal i'll say that but um, damn all that shit. This game right here, in case you haven't noticed, is Killzone 3. I love this game. Online is amazing. I played this a couple weeks ago, and um, I'm not too sure. I I'm, I planned on making this into a uh, game caviar show, but for whatever reason, it didn't happen, and it got, it got trumped by, uh, I think, a Modern Warfare video. I don't know. Fuck it. It got trumped by something. But anyway, this is a solid gameplay. Um, I still love this game. I still play it. I hope they come up with another one. I'm still glad there's people online that play it. it I didn't have any trouble getting into a server. And everything went smoothly as usual. And I love that shotgun. Um, I would like to have... If I, if I had the ultimate setup, I would have an LMG and a shotgun as a backup. But um, I, can, I can still go with the shotgun. It's all good, man. Fuck it. I'll do whatever. Rock out with my shotgun out. Anyway, Modern Warfare 3 is coming out next week, Tuesday, as I cut this guy's throat. He won't be there. He's not getting Modern Warfare 3. I cut his throat. Anyway, it's coming out next week. I already have it pre-ordered at GameStop. I'm getting the Xbox 360 Special Edition Modern Warfare 3 all up in your face. You see it, and you will cry tears of... Uh, surprise, I guess is what it is. Tears of endearment. Anyway, this bad boy comes with, listen to this shit. It comes with a big ass 320 gigabyte hard drive. I have an Xbox with a 20 gigabyte hard drive on it. And it sucks because I have games that I need to download. And I can't download them because I have to delete something else to make room for, you know, whatever I want to download. Anyway. Uh, customized Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 console with uh, these battle graphics on it. Uh, two customized, uh, customized Xbox 360 controllers, wireless controllers that match the uh, they match the console. Um, uh, standard edition of Modern Warfare 3 uh, Xbox Live download code uh, code for downloadable avatar items uh xbox 360 wired headset uh which i don't need i have like 10 of those fucking things laying around at one point in time i had six xbox 360s i used to buy them off ebay and i used to fix them because uh little known secret here xbox 360s were pretty shitty when they first came out and um it was very easy for me to get one and fix it and um and I just had one like in all of the rooms of my house, you know, and I and I would uh, I would um, bomb fix them and then I would sell them. So that's what I used to do. And that's why I also have all these damn Xbox 360 headsets laying around. Anyway, last but not least, it comes with one month of Xbox Live Gold, which I will be redeeming. Um. Uh, yeah, hold on. Let me. Uh, I'm responding to somebody on Facebook. Anyway, uh, I have a Twitter account. I'm on Twitter. Twitter.com slash not having it. Follow me. I will follow you back. I will talk to you. 
I don't want to be one of those guys who get like a big ass YouTube channel and not talk to people. I want to be very social in my, uh, you know, when, when, or if, I'll say when, I'm being optimistic, when my YouTube channel makes it big. Uh, so follow me, let me know, you know, holler at me, I'll holler back. We'll holler at each other on Twitter and act a fool. Uh, I'm trying to do some things with the damn channel to get it out there. If you guys have any ideas or anything that you know works that helps, uh, maybe you have a channel that, that's gotten, you know, big and you have some tips for me or stuff that I could do, you know, uh, you know, maybe a tactic that you, that you tried and worked out very well, let me know and I will try to incorporate everything that I can. I mean, I'm trying a lot of things right now. Everything except for getting, like, you know, my name drawn in the sky by fucking uh, Cessna Jet or renting a billboard or renting, like, local TV, you know, commercials and everything. Uh, but, yeah, I'm trying to get out there, man. I'm just doing this. I'm doing this because I like to do it. But at the same time, <clears throat> I want people to see me doing this because, you know, it's YouTube. Nobody puts videos on YouTube for them not to be seen by anybody okay so as this game switched we hit a switching point right here and if you see this game right here you look at this game you're like man this looks a lot like the last game he played it's made by the same people but this here is mag a game that came out a few years ago it didn't have a single player uh, um, element to it it was just online only it's three you pick a faction it's three factions and they fight against each other through different game modes <clears throat> they actually this is my first time playing this game in a long time so it took me a while to get used to everything and they changed a lot of stuff in the game which um i appreciate uh zipper interactive um like i said they're the same people who made so calm but <clears throat> this brings me to the point of what i read online the other day is said should uh developers remove single player campaigns from their games and i think that that would be the dumbest thing they could you could do for a developer for <clears throat> all of them to just not have single player campaigns because um if you do that you're letting developers get off easy you know and um i i think that developers if i'm paying 60 dollars for a game i want to make sure i want to feel like the game that I'm buying is worth it. And a lot of developers today are just not doing that. Uh, there was uh, Resistance 3 is one of the games that I absolutely loved. I played it, the single player campaign, and it was amazing. If you haven't played Resistance 3 and you have a PS3, please do so. Um, normally, I, I don't, um, games just, uh, Uncharted, Uncharted has always had a good storyline. I mean, just don't take off don't don't take out the single player campaign just make it better you know i don't care whether you have to call up steven spielberg or james cameron or um that that guy that does transformers i can't remember his name this is my second take and i still can't remember his name i should have googled it but i didn't think about it but anyway try just make them better just make it better you know uh, uh, the other alternative would be you could just sell the game the online campaign online as a download but see, even then, I don't understand. I don't think that'll work out because you know, I, I, I believe they would lose money by doing that. I don't know how that works out. But uh, anyway, this video is just about over. This has been a montage of forgotten gameplay videos. I will have another uh, video up here in the next couple of days. It's a lot of shit has been happening in the gaming community. I'm talking about Grand Theft Auto V uh, debut trailer. I'll talk about that. I'll talk about um. Rainbow Six just got announced. A new Rainbow Six game that's coming out in 2013. I'll talk about that. And just, you know, a rundown of all the games that are coming out. Modern Warfare 3 is the biggest one. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Um, I'm going to be coming out with a uh, with a contest here pretty soon. It's going to be for... I plan on getting an HD PVR. So I'm going to... Um, I'm probably going to give away this uh, Roxio game cap and the software. And... Um, I'll probably be giving away some uh, some Modern Warfare 3 uh, merchandise and things of that nature. Um, so, yeah, uh, hit me up.
Let me know. I'm not having it as always, and baby, I'm out.